Master Importing Tech for Hybrid Workspaces. Welcome to our video on importing office technology and equipment for hybrid workspaces and flexible work arrangements into the USA. In today's globalized world, businesses and organizations have evolved to embrace hybrid work models, which require state-of-the-art technology and equipment. In this video, we will discuss the key aspects of Customs Brokerage, Customs Bond, and Importer Security Filing ISF, that you need to be aware of when importing office technology and equipment. So, let's dive in. Understanding Customs Brokerage when importing office technology and equipment, it is essential to have a clear understanding of customs brokerage. Customs brokerage refers to the process of facilitating the import and export of goods on behalf of businesses and individuals. It involves ensuring compliance with customs regulations, managing paperwork, and communicating with government agencies on your behalf. A customs broker acts as a liaison between you and the customs authorities, ensuring that your goods are cleared smoothly, avoiding delays and penalties. They have the knowledge and expertise to navigate complex customs procedures and requirements, saving you time and effort. The importance of customs bond. When importing office technology and equipment into the USA, one crucial aspect to consider is obtaining a customs bond. A customs bond serves as a financial guarantee between the importer, you, and the customs authorities. It ensures that all duties, taxes, and fees related to the importation will be paid in full. Having a customs bond is a legal requirement for most commercial shipments entering the country. It not only helps to protect the revenue of the government but also safeguards you against any potential financial liabilities during the importation process. Overview of Importer Security Filing ISF. In addition to Customs Brokerage and Customs Bond, Importer Security Filing ISF, is another crucial element when importing office technology and equipment. ISF is a filing requirement enforced by the U.S. Customs and Border Protection CBP, agency. It aims to enhance cargo security and enable risk assessment before goods are loaded onto vessels destined for the USA. ISF requires importers or their agents to submit specific information about the imported goods, such as the shipper's name and address, consignee's name and address, and a detailed description of the cargo. This information must be filed with the CBP at least 24 hours before the goods are loaded onto the vessel at the port of origin. Compliance and Documentation to ensure a smooth importation process, it is crucial to comply with all customs regulations and provide accurate documentation. This includes having the necessary permits, licenses, and certifications for the office technology and equipment you are importing. Some common documents you may need to provide include a commercial invoice, packing list, bill of lading, airway bill, and any applicable licenses or certificates. Working closely with your customs broker will help ensure that all required documents are prepared accurately and submitted on time. Benefits of partnering with a customs broker. Partnering with a reputable customs broker can offer several benefits when importing office technology and equipment. They can provide guidance on import compliance, help you navigate complex customs procedures, and ensure that your goods clear customs efficiently. Additionally, customs brokers have access to advanced technology and systems that streamline the importation process. This allows for real-time tracking of your shipment, ensuring transparency and visibility at every stage. Importing office technology and equipment for hybrid workspaces and flexible work arrangements requires a thorough understanding of customs brokerage, customs bond, and importer security filing ISF. By working with an experienced customs broker, you can ensure compliance with customs regulations, obtain necessary customs bonds, and submit accurate ISF filings. Thank you for watching this video. We hope you found the information valuable. Stay tuned for our upcoming videos, where we will explore more topics related to international trade and customs brokerage. Disclaimer note below. See you next time.